Math 083 Final Exam Review Problem 3 Parts A and D To simplify a rational expression, it must be in factored form. In other words, all of the pieces must be multiplied and or divided together. In Part A, we have 48 times m to the 7th divided by 20 times m to the 4th. So we can divide down. Dividing 48 by 4, we get 12. Dividing 20 by the same 4, we get 5. The shortcut for simplifying a power of m divided by another power of m is to use the law of exponents where you subtract. And 7 minus 4 is 3. We begin the subtraction in the numerator, so that's where our result goes. m to the third goes in the numerator. So our answer is 12m to the third divided by 5. In part D, we must simplify this rational expression. Please note that since this expression has not been factored in the numerator and or denominator, this 3 and this 18 cannot be reduced down. In the denominator, we first factor out the greatest common factor, 2. We get 2 times the quantity m squared minus 9. The numerator cannot be factored. The denominator, however, can be factored again. It is the difference of perfect squares. It factors as m plus 3 times m minus 3. Now, 3 minus m and m minus 3 are opposites. And when you divide them down, you get negative 1 divided by positive 1. So our answer is negative 1 divided by 2 times the quantity m plus 3.